You ever feel lonely, even when you're around lots of different people? Or maybe right now, during this time of COVID-19, you're feeling lonely. We wanted to talk about that because there's a lot of information about loneliness that it may give you pause to think about it differently. A, US, a former U.S. Surgeon General, when he was Surgeon General, he went around the country and interviewed people who talked about, he, they didn't talk about loneliness, but they, they talked about feeling like, wow, I have the weight of the world on my shoulders, or if I were to disappear, die, nobody would notice. And what he realized is there's this theme of loneliness that we do not name, but we experience, and it's an epidemic in the United States. And he even found there are three types of connections that are crucial mm -hmm. in our relationships. One, the primary relationship with your spouse, that intimate connection. And then there's friends and family, which he called the social uh, connection. And then also being a part of a community. And if any one of those are not present, you could be experiencing that sense of loneliness. And so right now, I mean, what we found interesting as we've been talking to different people is in some respects, there's a deeper level of connection that's coming for families and friends, even intimacy at home because you're having to deal with things differently. And sometimes in right now, there might be a loss of it in terms of the broader community because you're not able to go to work in the way you did before. And so it's been interesting to even see how the, the patterns that we're having right now have possibly changed that loneliness. <laughs> but you can also think if you're feeling that sense of loneliness, you can think, wow, there must be something wrong in my relationship when you might be missing social uh, connection or community connection. And that's true at work too. Like our uh, community at work, we're rallied around a common purpose. And if we don't feel aligned with that common purpose, we can see, feel a loss of that connection of that work community. So yeah. noticing, we, we just wanted to raise this. It's a great book together is the name of the book. Uh, raise it so you can notice where do I have connections and where am I missing them and might need to create them. And my name's Chris Marie Campbell. I'm a leadership coach and I help leaders actually increase their performance by dealing with their mindset, reducing their stress and um, doing what they love. And I'm Susan Clark, and I am a relationship and leadership coach and work with people in the area of crisis, conflict, and change. And together, we work with teams on the areas of conflict, really developing that high-performing team based on trust and alignment. Have yeah. a good day.